The coastline around the UK is beautiful, but you won't find many coral reefs here. We're going to have to go a bit further into the ocean to find ourselves a coral reef to explore. But what is a coral reef? To help us answer that question, download the resource in the link below this video. It's packed full of information and activities. Corals are living organisms that form coral reefs, delicate ecosystems that look like colourful gardens under the sea. The largest coral reefs are in tropical waters. Their shallow, warm, clear water provides the perfect environment for the algae to photosynthesise. So we're going to have to go a lot further than this to find some coral reefs. So we're off to warmer waters, but where are we heading first? Let's look at the information cards in your resource pack. Let's start in Australia at the Great Barrier Reef, one of the largest areas of coral reef. The Great Barrier Reef was listed as one of the seven natural wonders of the world. Now to Egypt. Unlike many other reefs, the Red Sea Coral Reef can withstand extreme temperature changes. The Apo Reef in the Philippines is the second largest continuous coral system in the world. It's been a protected area since 1996. So that's just three and there are plenty more to discover. Take a look in your resource pack. You'll find the link in the description to this video. Corals have microscopic algae living inside their tissues, which gives the coral reef its beautiful colours. Let's take a closer look at some. It's challenge time. Let's have a look at some corals and their distinguishing features. Tube corals come in a variety of colours and shapes depending on the species. Unlike most corals, tube corals are usually found hanging down from a cave roof rather than growing up from the seabed. They can grow up to three feet tall. Which one do you think is a tube coral? If you chose this one, you're right! Elkhorn coral has large flat branches, which look like an elk's antlers. They provide an important home for many sea creatures such as lobster and parrotfish. They can grow as large as 12 feet wide. Which one do you think is an elkhorn coral? If you chose this one, you're correct! Let's take a look at one more. Table corals grow in large flat plates. This helps them get the maximum amount of sunlight. They can grow over three feet wide. They're green or dull brown in colour. But which one of these is a table coral? If you chose this one, you got it right. The coral reefs are in danger and they need our help. There's loads that you can do to help protect them, even if you don't live anywhere near them. Take a look in your resource pack to find out why the coral reefs are at risk and what you can do to help protect them. The largest coral reef in the world is the Great Barrier Reef off the coast of Queensland, Australia. But just how big is it? Let's think in terms of football pitches. What do you reckon? 10 football pitches? 100 football pitches? It can't be a thousand football pitches. Hmm, use your resource to go and find out just how big the Great Barrier Reef is. I think you might be surprised. The Great Barrier Reef is just one part of this brilliant resource. Go and check it out. Time for another challenge. Let's look at what else is living on the coral reef. Can you match the right picture with the name below? Here comes the answer. Did you get it right? How about this one? Pause the video if you need to. Here's the answers. Let's try one more. Let's see if you were right. Thanks for watching today. This video is part of a three part series of underwater adventures. Look out for the other two in the series, World Ocean Day and Sea Turtles. See you again soon. And don't forget, you can download the accompanying resource in the link below this video. Another great addition to your home ed journey.